everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Link's Birthday Deluxe for Zelda Classic Part 8. Today, we are going to attempt Level 6 deep in the Hylian Jungle, so let's go find it right now. And I know of where to find another bomb bag upgrade, so we're going to go collect that along the way. Hiya, Melee. That wizard does look like him, doesn't it? Looks like his avatar. Oh, uh, let's see. Oh no, I killed the frog! I should be ashamed. I have nothing against frogs, he was just in the wrong place at the wrong time. There. Made some calamari out of that Octoraki. Okay, go down off this raft path. Yeah, we'll find our next bomb bag upgrade over here. Yeah, I gotta hit that blue bush. Super Seeker's awesome staircase. Your bomb bag looks very small. Yes, we've been through this like six other times. And now my bomb count goes up to 30. Epicness. And the more bomb bag upgrades you get, the more super bombs you can also carry. So that's pretty swift. Alright, and now it's time to find the entrance to the Hylian Jungle. And I unveiled it earlier in some other part. So hopefully I can find my way back there again. And I think it's going to be right down this path. Be nice if I could run into another heart piece and get another full heart container. And here's the Hylian Jungle. And now our next objective is to find the level 6 key. Oh, die. Cheap shot. Ah, oh, you bastards. That was a load of bull. Yeah, they don't look like moblins. They look like bull men. Those sharp, pointy horns. You're the devil in disguise. Oh, yeah, we had to hit this switch. And now we got a shortcut back to the Hylian jungle. Yay. Okay, anything nifty down here? Got spike traps in the overworld. Major eeks. Watch out going over here. Oh boy. Well, yeah, they come out awfully quick here. And we got a spike maze with a lot of pits. Yeah, there's actually a heart piece we can get in there, but I'll get it later. Right now, I'm hell bent on getting level 6 done first. Take that. And speaking of level 6, there it is, and there's the key with it. Aha! Now we gotta work our way around to level 6. And I don't know what this little cave is, but we need a super bomb to blow away that mount that cracked mountain block. Actually, I think there's a bomb shop over here we can visit. So we can get that taken care of right now. And I'm kinda curious to see what's in that house. That jungle's pretty big. Okay, now we can exit. Watch out for the Lionel's exiting. Okay, now I think we need to... Oh, blow a whistle! I forgot you had to do that here. So stand on the whistle marker, get your ocarina out, and play that funky music yet again. And the rock will move. Yes, I want super bombs. Gimme! Gimme, gimme, gimme. I'm gonna buy like four of these suckers. Gonna need one for the Eastern Tower later, and I need one to blow away that, uh... That mountain block next to that stone cave place. And if I need any more, I'll come back later. Yeah, going this direction will take you towards level 7, but that's going to be for much later. And it looks like we're going to need a super bomb to get through that place, too. Hi, Whirlpool. Bye, Whirlpool. Alright, let's see what's in here. I want to find out. Plant super bomb, run away! That covers a huge radius. I 
think that's like the ultimate wallet. Hooray! Now we can carry an immense amount of money. Alright, no more time wasting, let's get to level 6. We're gonna be spending the rest of the part in there. Clear out these weeds and bushes and, well, pitfalls. Yikes. And here we are at level 6. That didn't take long, did it? Jungle Fortress. And we got the Fire Tribble making their debut. As you can see, with the Magical Sword, they still split. And Super Secret Awesome Entrance! Or, yeah. Or Super Secret Passageway, I should have said. Yes, debut of Red Wizard Robes, too. And we get a map. Good to have. Love this music, too. Like I said, Z's music choices are perfect for this game. I think I see a crack there. Bomb it! Secret up here? No, nothing. Okay, got some red, red wizard robes greeting us here. Let's greet them first! Sword to the face. Or we'll drown them. Aha! Give me that gold. And now let's go to the right. Oh my god, killer bunnies! It's wabbit hunting season, ha <laughs> Get owned! And another super secret awesome passageway. Slice the vine down. And another small key. Two already. I'm getting scared. Two keys that were not even two minutes into the dungeon yet. Oh, let's see. Give those. Oh boy. Yeah, they're going to be absorbing a lot of sword beams. Better hit them with the actual sword. Do more damage. Sword beams have been nerfed. And really, nothing else over here, huh? This is a dead end. Okay. I guess we're going back upstairs. And up we go. And you guys die again. And through here. Yeah, this poison mist here, do not go in, you will take damage. There's an item you need in this dungeon to protect you from it. So go down instead. Okay, we can go this way. But first I want to go downstairs, see if we missed anything here. Oh yes, new area, let's explore. Yeah, not so linear at the moment. I think I know where that room takes us back to, so let's go right. Aha! Okay, Wizard of Bats. Time to dissect you. Come on. Into the sword beam. Oh, I think I know what we need to do. Yes. There's another way to attempt this room. And it's the proper way. And yep, it did take me back here as I thought it would. Not that we're going to be backtracking too far anyhow. Okay, let's go back down here again. Actually, let me check the right first. Hmm. Okay, we do get an item here. Let's drop the barricade. Alright, kill the Wizard Bat, and now let's get our hook shut. And pick up the Compass! So that was the reason for going right. And now we go back down. And now let's go back- oh, wait, 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 no, no. Back up, back up, back up. Oh, uh, let's see. Uh, back to my boomerang, I guess. Hey, cut it out, you. Lethal wings there. There we go. And now we go to the right. Yeah, see that pit to the far right after you hammer down those uh, moles? Yeah, we gotta fall down that hole. It's gonna take us to the other side of that pit. There we can get our key. So let's hammer these guys down, get our prize. 
Alright, now let's quickly exit this room. Before these baddies pound on us. And you can use the hookshot for invincibility frames too. As long as it's extending out, all enemies will pass through you and the attacks. So it's great for avoiding damage too, if you time it well. Because timing is everything. Okay, let's go straight through here. Oh boy, got a mix of fire, triple, and gimdos. And I actually have another small key to go through the uh, locked door to the right, to the left. Black. I don't even know my directions anymore. Bad TK. The secret lies beyond the overgrown vegetation. In other words, hack down vines to find hidden doors. So yeah. I've already exploited that to you. Okay, now let's get our lantern out. Drop the barricade, and through the locked door. Oh boy, we got some Paul's voice again. Kill the white wabbits. Call them ghost bunnies. Or marshmallow bunnies. Either way, they're fluffy. Alright, whiz bitches. You don't want any of this. Okay, now... Oh, go downstairs. Let's check it out. Before we go north. Okay, no super secret awesome doorway there. I gotta stop saying that. Okay, in this room, uh... We're going nowhere, apparently. So, back up. We're entering that room from a different direction, it seems. And I gotta remember to come back to this room later. Small key for when we can pick up the flippers later. Okay, let's boomerang this, see what it does. Oh, drops the barricade, okay. Alright, this room... Whoa! Didn't see those wizard ropes till the last second. Damn you flickering animation! Oh, I just saw what happened now. Oh, poopers, I kinda screwed myself now. Gotta fall down the hole. Thankfully, thankfully we're not taking too far back. Kill these gibdos, get them out of the way. Anything up here? No. Yeah, it was another super secret awesome passageway. TK, stop. I'm abusing that Yu-Gi-Oh! upbridge reference, man. I gotta stop. I'm beating it about as bad as a dead horse right now. Hit this. Now we gotta be careful not to wander in front of the Cyclops statues. Gotta go behind them. So that way the barricade stays up. Now we go left. Okay, is there a secret behind these vines? No, nothing. But there is a secret in the water to the left, though. Got a staircase underwater. Yeah, need the flippers to get to it, though. Let me check this one. Nothing, okay. Going down, I guess. Now we got more cryptos. Let's unravel these mummies. And don't go back, there's actually a secret in this room. Lo and behold, yeah. Staircase leading downward. And now it's time to slay some more bunnies. Let's make s'mores with them. I mean, I have fire, I have the white bunnies. Where's the ground crackers now? Oh yeah, in this room you gotta hit a one-eyed Cyclops statue. Drop the barricade, but don't go past that yet. Got a crack in the foundation, bomb it. Okay, so much for that. We'll come back later when we get the uh, the item we need to get through that room. So, open your eye and die again. And I think we're coming towards the first item of the dungeon. We're going towards it. Hook shot across the water. And keep on keeping on to the right. Alright, wipe out all these red whiz rubs again. Yeah, they appear. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Man, sometimes they're not appearing at all to the last second. And then sometimes they appear on cue. They're playing mind games. I don't like it. 
Okay, push this block on there. There we go. Open up the door to the right. And we got two wizard bats in here. They're a joke. Now we come down here. And mid-boss time! We got blue dark nuts. Oh boy, now I'm gonna get pounded. Profusely. I'm glad the hammer doesn't dispel the uh, bushes either. So I can hide behind them. Not that I really need to. Oh. Yes, for this particular treasure, you need to activate a star switch to open it. And we pick up the... Poison Orb, I'm gonna call it. And what the Poison Orb does is it takes away the poison's ability to hurt you. So now you can enter those rooms safely. And I'll give you an example in a moment once I get back to one of those rooms. Yeah, we still gotta find the flippers and the boss key, though, and then hopefully get to our Triforce piece. Okay, let's arrow that eye switch. Alright, now we can actually go up here without worrying about damage. Now we go into the middle of the room, push the block on the switch, open the north, let's go. Now we kill more mummy men. We're gonna pick up another small key after we're done. Yes, give me the small key, I want... I kind of have a pretty good idea. Uh, do you? I didn't expect you to spawn there. Evil hopping whiskers. Okay, let's go back up here now. Oh man, I gotta kill you guys again. No fun. Yep, pointless to come back here again. Well, at least till we get the flippers. Is this room above we gotta come back to later? Oh yeah, you see the gold-tinted uh, locked door to the north? You need the boss key to open those. Yeah, the silver-tinted locks you use for the... Uh... Yeah, actually, I'm going to go backwards a little bit. So we're going to end game. No, don't reset. Don't do that. Please don't do that. Because there was actually a poison mist room near the start that I want to hit. Saves me a little bit of backtracking, too. Aha, here we go. No! I forgot about that hole in the middle of the room there. Open up your eyes, TK. God gave you them for a reason. Yeah. Had to walk around. There we go. And now we just go straight up. Into this room. Where we kill the mummy men again. Goodbye, Gibdos. Not stepping on my toes. Drop the barricade, and now we go down the steps. And now we appear at the top portion of this room. So I think there's another small key we have to collect up here. Yeah, watch out, we got traps in close proximity here. So you don't have a lot of room to react. Okay, let's go this way now. Now we kill the whiz ropes. There we go. And now we get another small key. Yay! That makes two! Arrow that, drop that down, and now we exit. And I'm sure you can guess where this uh, hammer spot's gonna take us. Right into this room, on this side. So now we're back to where we... So now we're back to where we started, sort of. Which is fine. Now we don't backtrack again until we get the flippers. Get my fairy, and now let's go up the steps. Alright, let's get rid of these guys now. Okay, now we continue up here. Arrow you! I love moving targets. Tis fun. Give me money. Okay, now we gotta go around the room to dodge the Cyclops statues. And now we go this way. See, you needed another small key, so that's why I went back and got the other one. 
And here we get the flippers! Awesome! Alright, now I know exactly where I need to go next. Oh! God damn it! Ugh, that sucks. But it could be a blessing in disguise because it'll prevent me from forgetting this one key I want to get. So, not all that bad, I guess. And, that ah, you son of a bitch. Okay, um... Oh, come on, they're back again! They should stay dead for at least, like, five minutes. So annoying. Get over here and watch you. Not in that way, just for my life. Okay, now that we're back in this room, let's grab the small key while we're in the neighborhood. Since we've got the flippers, swim over and grab it. Okay, now, uh... Boomerang out. Now we gotta go up and around again. Okay, now we can actually dive into the staircase here. So let's go. Yep, transfers us to the other side of this room. Watch out, the Baba Bunnies will try to kill you. They may look friendly, but they're anything but. Oh, got another way to go here. Go north, through the vines. But what the heck was to the left, though? Did we explore the left yet? I can't even see. Oh, this room. Okay, nothing happens in here, so yeah. Back through the north. Yeah, watch, I got two fast-moving traps here. Just dive and dodge them. Now, this is gonna be a bit tricky, however. Yeah, you're gonna get hit no matter what on that one, because you just don't have enough reaction time to get out of the way. But then again, my reaction time never was really that great to begin with. Yeah, so many whiz robes in here. It's not the blue, so I can't complain too much. Alright, let's go to the left here, see what we got. Yeah, we're nearing the end of this dungeon, not too much more to go. Okay, you die now. Get over here. I think we go down here. Yep, takes us towards, uh... I think this is another small key. Yes. Oh god, oh god, move! I thought they were gonna hit me while I was holding the key. That would've been frightening. Okay, let's see what I need to do now. I think I have a pretty good idea. Yes, we go down here. Kill these wizard bats. And yep, unlock both of these doors. Yeah, you might think there's nothing in this room, but if you look closely, there is. Beyond the vine, another staircase. And here's where we find the big key. So now we can finally wrap up this bad boy. So we're almost done with this dungeon. Yay, big key is mine! Alrighty, and now we're gonna... Now that we have the big key in our possession, we can unlock all those gold-tinted doors. And backtrack towards the boss room. So yeah, now we're just going around again. And now it's time to challenge the boss for our sixth Triforce piece. And it's going to be... Oh my! It's a Super Manandala, supported by two regular Manandalas. So just spam bombs and you'll kill. Wow, one shot at- Damn, dude! Already! <laughs> That's the second time ever I one shot at a Super Manandala with a regular bomb. That was epic. Anyways, that's level 6 done, folks. Our sixth piece of Triforce collected. Hooray! Just two pieces left. We're almost done. The temple near Hyrule Town, the Fire and Water Temple, was built in order to keep the gods content. But now only monsters come there. The Fire and Water Temple? Who goes there nowadays? It's too dangerous, no matter who you are. 
You had better hurry up. I can't stop Ganon much longer. Good luck, Link. Alright, that does it for level 2. Oh, uh, not level 2. Level 6. Gah! Man. What is with me in numbers today? I think I need to eat. I'm just not thinking very well right now. I haven't eaten much at all today. Might order a Papa John's pizza. Kind of feeling up for one. Get me a Pepsi with it. Mm. Alright, enough talk about food. I'm gonna do ex some exploring through the jungle for the rest of this part. No, I already went that way. I'm actually, I'm actually gonna see if I can get that uh, heart piece from that one maze here. Would be amazing! Ha ha ha. Horrible, I know. Alright, uh, I gotta find a way to get into that maze. I think I gotta go the other way. Damn it, those spikes come up a lot quicker in the overworld. Ooh! They come up like two seconds early. They're punishing my heart containers. Let's go through... Oh man, you can't go that way. Oh wait, ooh! Oh, money in the tree! Nice. Ah, I think... Oh, you can't go that way either. Damn it. Too restricting. Hmm. Let's break through these moblins. I'm gonna see if I can get this maze done in time. I make no guarantees, though. And these friggin' spikes, man. Pissing me off. Come on, hurry up. Drop. Go, go, go. Come on, Moblin, get over here. Alright, I think we got to it. Yeah, oh, uh, no, not quite. We gotta go back around. Damn it. Yeah, Z set this maze up in a way where you really have to bob and weave around here. It's gonna get annoying. Hmm. Okay, I think I see how to get there. Maybe. Or not. Or... Ugh, if I had the four-way ladder, this wouldn't be a problem. I know I gotta enter this maze from a different direction. Hmm. And I think we'll solve the mystery of this in the next part, probably. Unless I can somehow figure it out now. Oh, wait, 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 I think I know. Go down the other way! Yeah, I think we gotta take this long path to get there. Whee! Hmm. Yes, I see what needs to be done now. Oh, hey! No pop shotting me! Yay! Another full heart container! Woot! And on that happy little note, folks, we're gonna end it here. Stay tuned for Let's Play Legend of Zelda Link's Birthday Deluxe for Zelda Classic Part 9. When we'll do some more overworld trekking and then we'll tackle level 7. And quite possibly hit the Eastern Tower afterwards in the following part. Anyways, see you then, peoples!